Hello and welcome to Kindred Spirit Tarot. This is your weekend message for Saturday the 23rd going into Sunday the 24th of May 2020. Thank you so much for joining me. If it's your first visit, welcome. If you are returning, then welcome back and thank you. For this weekend's reading, I am using the Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Kranz. Okay, let's see what wonderful message Spirit has for us for this weekend. Okay, here we go. Thank you. I do believe it is you. What is the message for my wonderful friends from Spirit? Too many. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Very lively cards for oh, Saturday the 23rd going into Sunday the 24th of May 2020. What do my wonderful friends need to know? Well, let's find out, shall we? Here we go. Major Arcana, number seven, Chariot. Uh, when I first picked this uh, deck up initially, um, this card was on the bottom um, and I'm really drawn to uh, the energy of Ruby. Uh, Major Arcana, number seven, the chariot. Wow, followed by Major Arcana, number 18, the moon. And we have just had our beautiful new moon energy. Oh, OK, here we go. Oh, the three of cups. Three little birds, Bob Marley, <laughs> straight away going through my mind. A wonderful song. OK, well, I'm really looking at the, this ruby red in the corners of this and I'm, I'm really feeling the energy, the presence um, of ruby, the kind red spirit. OK, your first card is Major Arcana. Number seven, the chariot. Major arcanas, they speak of your inner world, your inner knowing, your major inner knowledge. And the chariot uh, is uh, attached to um, cancer, um, a water sign. Uh, Ruby wasn't uh, cancer, but she was Pisces. So uh, I'm feeling the, um, the watery energy uh, today coming from this card. Um, the first thing I'm focused on is uh, all of this energy radiating out, uh, whether it is depicting the uh, moon um, or the sun. Um, from both of these energies, they are your male and masculine side, your polarity. Uh, you've, you've got it together, friends. You have pulled things together. Uh, you have been determined. You have uh, had the drive. You have had the willpower the focus um, you I'm going back to leadership again my friends because I'm it's really been very strong uh, for those of you that have been on this path for a long time you you are becoming leaders uh, way showers uh, light workers uh, setting uh, a example leading by example and I'm really feeling that this is what's occurring with the energy of this card um, it is leadership, it's, it's skills, uh, it's you overcoming um, any obstacle, um, overcoming all adversity and it's because of this willpower I'm picking up on, this energy, never giving up, never giving up. Each day you have gone out and you have worked with this horse, played with this horse groomed and fed this horse, got to know this horse as much as, as if it was your inner spirit and that is what it is representing. So you, your polarity, your masculine and feminine side and the spirit in the middle, uh, although it's number seven, for me it is the, um, the energy of number three of um, authenticity, of mind, body, spirit, thoughts, words and actions, 
all going in the same direction. When you do that, my friends, you are unstoppable. Uh, and seven is the number of magic. It's the number of spirituality. Uh, it's the number of research. So it's putting in the research. It, um, it's diligence. And you certainly have been very diligent here. Um, and it's uh, at the energy of ambition. And I can see that you have uh, been am very ambitious. Uh, and it's also, friends, it's a job well done. You can truly congratulate yourselves today. Um, you've really kind of pulled yourselves together. Um, and all parts of you are all going in the same direction. Wonderful. Next you have Major Arcana. Number 18, the moon. And this is Pisces energy. So I truly feel that, we, that Ruby is um, around us. Uh, her presence is here uh, at the moment. I'm truly picking up on that. Uh, one and eight, adding up to number nine, the number of completion, the number of reaching an ideal, having your dreams come true, the number of leadership yet again. Um, this is really, really prominent, my friends. And as I look at this illustration of the moon, uh, we have the two trees again. This is representing your the polarity, your light and dark um, masculine and feminine uh your positive and negative uh your um and, and you you sorry and you um i feel here being represented by the moon energy uh again in the middle um so with the moon energy you have really developed uh you have developed your um intuition you have developed your insight uh developed your um powers of um of intuition and, and your psychic powers if you like um this is um again i'm really drawn to how black it is in the in the background but of course the moon here uh, illuminating uh, so you see thing through things now this is the awakening of your psychic powers people can no longer um be um disingenuous around you why because you would know you know the truth um when anybody s speaks it's it's like you're a um you're a natural statement analysis <laughs> and you can read between the lines you can see the truth in everything this is deep inner knowing deep insight deep inner wisdom that has been gained uh, because of all of this diligence determination willpower that you have been putting in this focus there's real focused energy um Oh, I'm loving it, friends. This is wonderful. So if anything isn't as it seems, you are going to see it straight away, my friends. You're going to see the truth in everything. Wow. And next we have the three of cups. So this is now back in the physical. The major arcanas talk about your inner world, your inner knowing, your major inner knowledge. And this is real deep insight which spills out into your physical, your material world, your reality, that that you see around you. Um, and again, I'm really he hearing Bob Marley's Three Little Birds, a real um, the lightheartedness, happiness of that tune. Um, and I'm feeling the... Um, the energy of these um, of these birds, the birdies, and you know, chattering. There's real conversation. There's real communication going on, and there's no um, there's no power structure here. Um, everyone's on the same branch. Everyone is on equal footing. Nobody sees themselves above anyone else, uh, and they are all looking to the same horizon. They are all looking to the same sun. They are all having the same sun shining down on them. The three, um, the number three, sorry, is for me, mind, body, spirit, thoughts, words, actions, um, you being congruent, all going in the same direction. This is you being your authentic, genuine selves, letting out your your true nature, your true spirit. And you are not bothered who who sees your true self Um all of your thoughts and all of your feelings and all of your actions truly, truly matching. People are 
in under no illusion when they are around you that you are um, a real honest genuine nature spirit um, and the three of cups it's celebration um, and we, I think we did have this card before didn't we with the um, the green witch tarot um, where we had the three ladies celebrating it is a a card of celebration it's mind body spirit all of your cups are full uh, there is nothing here for you to do my friends but enjoy this sunset in other words enjoy where you are now you are on the path you are on the right path the path to truth uh, the path of freedom and here i do see that you are liberated you are free free to be you under the sun <laughs> wow 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 okay next we will have the wild unknown animal spirit by kim crams <clears throat> What is the message from spirit thank you okay <clears throat> i will just lower the camera for you my friends there we go and your animal spirit card is oh whale uh at the element of water uh, of course whales go really really deep so again depth deep deep inner knowing deep insight wow 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 okay let's find whale bear with me it was probably right at the end <laughs> well yes i think it is yeah <laughs> okay whale desire to delve deeper profound peace and ancient wisdom the whale represents profound emotional health and stability whale personalities are not afraid of emotional expression or traversing difficult terrain as they have overcome many many challenges in their lives these experiences have enriched them given them stability strength and a depth that is rare Whale energy is usually linked to the feminine forces of compassion and communication. We can depend on whale personalities when all else seems lost and trust them to be our beacon in to be a beacon in our darkest hour. When you are in balance, you are calm, steady and deeply compassionate. When you are out of balance, you're heavy and you slip into your old story and to bring you back into balance, regular self-care. <laughs> OK, well, for me, perfectly matching. Um, I'm really feeling this deep, this depth, this you going deeper. All the while you are going deeper. There is no limit to how deep that you can go to to really know your true self, my wonderful friends. OK, Wisdom of the Oracle, Colette Baron reed called me next. <clears throat> the message for my wonderful friends oh two okay <clears throat> we can have two we have time I, I feel it is like that okay so your first one number six not for you and next we have 28 building blocks wow okay so first you have six not for you a clear knowing that something is being denied is being denied you is rejection is god's protection there are times when it appears that no matter how deeply you desire something and no matter how hard you work at something the result you seek always seems to elude you it's as if you don't really get to be in the game 
and you feel that you are just watching from the sidelines. The appearance of this card indicates that you are not going to attain what you want right now, that indeed your dreams for that exact thing will not be fulfilled. This is a time to radically accept that not everything is available to you when you want it. Take heart, for there are benevolent forces who desire the best for you and have a much clearer idea of what is for your highest good. Rejection is God's protection and something much better that will make you truly happy is on its way. So trust this. Wow, wow, wow. OK, next. Um, OK, and six number of balance and harmony. So, um, you know, by um, really going deep, fine tuning, uh, real de deep inner knowing and insight, uh, developing your psychic powers, knowing when to make a, a move on the chessboard, when to make a strategic move forward, um, or when to, you know, um, hold or hang back for a while, see if anything better is going to come. OK, well, next we had number 28, which was building blocks. <clears throat> and of course, two and eight adding up to the wonderful number 10, uh, the number of culmination, the ultimate reaching the peak <laughs> endings and beginning so uh, with it being the building blocks this is what i'm seeing again this is the foundation that we spoke of yesterday you truly building now a solid foundation for you to be coming from strong foundations a beautiful work in progress you have everything you need to cultivate an extraordinary life this is a time when your focus needs to be on the foundations you build upon. Wow. Your work, your relationships and your very being are underwritten by your values, ethics, morals and core beliefs. Are they still true for you? Will they stand the test of time and serve as the solid grounding upon which you construct your life? Now you are making changes that will affect everything in a positive way. Your destiny is, a tru is truly a remarkable and beautiful design. Wow. So changes, all, all good positive things on their way to you, my friends. And it's this deep, this deep, how deep you are going. Deep inner knowing, deep insight, developing um, your deep... Um, Sorry, developing your psychic powers. Oh, knowing the truth all the time. <laughs> so knowing which way to go. Oracle of the Unicorns, Cordelia Francesca Brabs, whom I lovingly call my trusty steeds. And let's call on Ruby now, the kind red spirit. And she's just inspired me and said, doesn't the underneath the whale look like a lovely shade of ruby red? <laughs> Oh, Ruby. Woo! OK, well, there we go. She already knew exactly the card she wanted for you, my friend. So, your card from Ruby, the kind red spirit, is... Oh, yes. Uh, and it's at the right time. And she's actually asking me to do this. She said, now... Now you are dancing, perfect partner with, with your horse, uh, the horse representing uh, spirit, your soul. Perfect partners, um, making a beautiful picture together. Um, anybody that's looking at you now, looking, uh, they are looking up to you. Uh, they are picking up on this leadership. They are picking up on all the uh, skills and all of this um, <clears throat> determination and, um, and and diligence that you have put in all of the research and all of the training and all of the hard work that you have put into yourself uh, it's your time to shine my friends I am really here this it's your time is now 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 Ruby says be clear and decisive 
focus on what you really want and be bold with your requests to the universe. So I'm going to go back, give you a little horse riding lesson. Uh, when you are sat astride your trusty steed and you are trying to attain some perfect balance, in other, in other words, you have got equal weight either side of your horse in, in, in each foot, in each stirrup if you had a saddle on. Um, you would like your each of your shoulders to kind of line up with each ear and your vision straight between those horses ears and focused in front of you uh, almost I, I used to like uh, pretend I'd got a pen and I would draw a line um, in front of Ruby and myself and in my imagination we would follow the line uh, it's clear and precise um, uh, it's clear and precise instruction Ooh, <laughs> clear and precise. It's clarity. OK, well, let's see what the message is from Ruby, the kind red spirit. She says, when you focus on what you want with laser sharp clarity, you have the power to part seas and move mountains. What may now seem out of reach can come to you if you believe it in it with all of your heart. Command it with clear intention and let the universe find the best way to bring it to you. And then take courageous action as guided. You may sense that your desires are being delayed or not arriving at all because you are sending out a muddled or timid request. Perhaps you are not sending out any desires at all. You will create a default, default reality based on your old patterns and beliefs unless you use intention to manifest what you want. Avoid being trapped in the same dramas, the same experiences and the same disappointments by setting strong new intentions now. This glorious winged horse urges you to remember that you are the powerful creator of your reality, whether you are doing so consciously or unconsciously. Wow. He urges you to use focused intention to command in your blessings and deliberately create a life that lights you up. You are an infinite being tapped into unlimited possibilities and you can choose and create your reality right now. So choose a life that astounds you with its magnificence and stand in your power as a co-creator with the divine and stay strong in your clear intention to live your highest life. Oh friends from the deepest darkest depths you are about to live your highest life ever wow 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 oh what a weekend my wonderful friends thank you spirit thank you ruby for sure um Oh, wow. Uh, celebrate this weekend, my friends. Your foundations are um, strong, getting stronger by the day. Your connection with the divine and with you, with you um, it's developing, it is growing, it is deepening. And, oh, friends, it is giving you clear and precise focus and intention. You know what you want, you know how to go and get it, and you know it's just a matter of connecting with the divine, putting it out there and leaving it all up to divine timing. And while you wait, just celebrate. Watch a few sunrises and sunsets with your friends. Fill your cup. <laughs> okay, well, I did an affirmation, so let's see how we go okay I wrote while the wind of change blows right through I have the tools and skills to know in each moment just what to do and you do my friends because of, of this development of you really developing your skills uh, you've got more tools in your toolbox uh, and you really know how to use these to uh, these tools you're becoming more skilled at what you do my friends that is why now you have this clear precise laser sharp 
clarity, this focus, uh, no limit, and you know there are no limits. Wow, wow, wow. Thank you for all of your likes, your shares. Welcome new subscribers. Thank you so much for your support. You have joined a wonderful family of kindred spirits. Thank you too for your warm, kind, encouraging comments and emails. I really enjoy receiving them, so do keep them coming. And so, my wonderful friends, may favour be with you all. And may you all have a wonderful weekend. And as I wish you a joyful, a peaceful and a truly blessed weekend. And until Monday, my friends, goodbye.